All right, check this out. I'm back here in the poinsettia grow range and they are starting to show color now, even though it's not even Halloween yet. So let's take a look at them and I'll explain how and why they're starting to turn. So if you didn't know this, poinsettias all start off a dark green color like you see here. Regardless of which color they finish, they all start off the same color. And then over a period of time, they'll actually start to blush and then they'll actually turn their full colors. For example, on these reds right here, within a few more weeks, you will no longer be able to see any green left in this whole range. It's just gonna be a solid sea of red. And same for these whites, they start off green and then you can see they're starting to get that creamy white color to them now. Here's the difference between the whites on the left and the reds on the right there. So a couple of things to point out. First of all, the color you see on poinsettias is not actually flowers. What you are seeing are modified leaves called floral bracts that give you all of the color. The flowers themselves are actually really small and they're gonna be right at the tip of the stem in between the floral bracts. Let me see if I can find one for you. Okay, this one here is Prinsettia Pure White and the flowers are just these little kind of BB sized buds in there. They will open up a little bit, but the color actually comes from the black bracts which are surrounding the flowers. Now there is one exception to the poinsettias all starting off dark green, and that would be this one here, which is the variegated variety. This one is called tapestry. It's got the nice yellow variegated leaves, and then these bracts will turn darker red as they continue to develop. So what triggers the poinsettias to bloom near Christmas time? So poinsettias are actually what are called a photoperiodic plant, which means that they bloom based on the ratio of darkness to light. So as the nights get longer and the days get shorter and they can get 12 to 13 hours of uninterrupted darkness, that will trigger them to then go into this bloom process. And that happens naturally in the fall going into winter. And that's why these plants out in the wild in Mexico will actually bloom right around Christmas time. And these are right on schedule to be looking at their peak in November and December for people to take home and decorate their homes with. And we'll check back in a couple of weeks and you will see a crazy amount of difference in this greenhouse range.